fallen hero. Tonight we're learning more about a Providence soldier killed in the line of duty. Sergeant Dennis Weichel was hit by an armored vehicle after moving an Afghan child to safety. Today we sat down with his captain who says Weichel's heroic act is no surprise to him. Iowa News News reporter Steve Nielsen joins us now with the details live in the newsroom. Tragic and heroic details have poured in about the last moments of Weichel's life. And now we're uncovering more about the man he was from a soldier who knew him well. I wasn't surprised. I know he would have done that for anyone. Captain Chris Allemeyer is talking about Sergeant Dennis Weichel, the Rhode Island National Guard member who lost his life in Afghanistan last week. The military says Weichel was struck by an armored vehicle when he rushed in to pull a child to safety. Weichel was a 29-year-old father of three from Pawtucket. I believe he saw his, his children in that, that Afghan child. And, and he... He, he, he made the ultimate sacrifice. Allemeyer was Weichel's captain. They knew each other since 2004. He recounted hearing the news of Weichel's death. Yeah, it was early in the morning, and you know, I had to pull over and collect myself to really, really, to really sink in. I don't think it truly has yet, because you know, he was, he was a, a brother in arms. And Flags in Rhode Island are at half staff in honor of Weichel, who joined the National Guard in 2001. He wanted to be a part of something bigger than him. He wanted to be a part of, of making a difference and and he did since his sacrifice he's been promoted from specialist to sergeant and awarded the bronze star weichel's body will return to rhode island tomorrow at 10 a.m at tf green and then his wake is scheduled for 4 p.m sunday that'll be at olson and parent funeral home in providence and you can count on eyewitness news for continued coverage and go to wpri.com for more details reporting live in the newsroom i'm steve nielsen eyewitness news